Hello folks, Tamara here with Minard's Leisure World. Today I'm going to walk you through the 2023 Keystone 401 LOFT. If you can spell that says loft, which obviously we've got one inside. So don't be distracted by our water here. We pulled it inside, it's a little cool today. I'm picky, so I wanted to be inside to film it uh, and give you guys the best views that we can. Um, so this is a destination model. Obviously, as you guys can see, it is not meant to be towed around seasonal sites, um, you know, park sites, something like that. Uh, but it's a great, great option for a family. Okay, starting right up here at the front, I wanna tell you guys, this hitch is removable. So once you get this set on your lot, pop that off so you're not walking around it. Makes it look a little nicer too. And then you do have two 20 pound propane tanks here. You probably, if you have a seasonal, have a storage shed they can stay in. So you're gonna wanna put those away uh, when you're not using them. This is a front living model. So uh, we carry a couple different plans of these guys. We wanna be able that no matter what your site is, if you're backing the lake, if you're looking at a golf course, anything like that, we wanna accommodate you. So this is that front living, great big windows on the front, nice big windows on campsite. Let's check out the inside. Okay, never mind. One more stop before we go inside. Uh, great big awning on this side. So campsite slide, as you can see, you're probably not gonna worry too much about that if you're looking at a destination model because you're looking for space inside. So huge awning covering that bedroom door entrance there. You've got sliding patio doors, which will be your main entrance here. And then you've got outdoor speakers out here as well. Okay, I am inside the 2023 Keystone 401 Loft. They have done some major updates this year. We are loving them. Um, come from a bit of a design background and I think they absolutely nailed it in here. So I'm going to start right up here in the front living room. We've got theater seats right here, really beautiful cloth material, nice big oversized sofa. We've got storage in here. We've got cup holders. And like I said, we've got recliners here as well. If I sit down, I'm not going to get back up. So <laughs> we're going to leave that there. Turn it around here. You've got your sofa here. It is a trifold. So this is an extra sleeping space if you do head, end up having some company. Um, really though, this is the family model. You got the loft upstairs, bedroom in the back. This would probably be last resort for having anybody sleeping on there. All of these beautiful, I want to say wood style blinds. You just pull the string, they close. Um, you've got the, all the campsite windows, like I mentioned outside here as well. Little end tables on each side of the couch, which is a bonus. Cubby storage underneath there too. Okay. The entertainment stand. I love this. So we've got the fireplace going warming us up here. These are great because you can change the colors to whatever mood you're feeling. Really nice large TV. I don't know what size it is, you guys. I forgot to check before I came out here, but it's big. We've got a built-in DVD player with all of your radio accessories down here. And then we've got tons of nice deep storage up here as well. Into the kitchen we go. One of my favorite parts of this trailer is this huge pantry that they offer. So it does have the motion light in here, so you can set it. So when you open the door, the light comes on. I just turned it on. We've got lip shelves here. You're not traveling with this anyways. It doesn't really matter, but it is nice to know that your stuff's not going to fly off. And there is room in here for a broom as well. So nice bonus. They did a really nice etching on the glass here too for a little extra detail. Look at all this counter space. You can prep lots of meals in here for the fam, or maybe dad's doing all the barbecuing. I don't know, but you got tons of solid surface countertop here beside the oven. Speaking of oven, it's a pretty decent size in there. That's wonderful. Uh, two pieces here. They do the three burner gas cooktop and then they do the oven separate. So it's a really, really nice residential looking finish. Extra large microwave up here. Convection microwave at that. So another bonus, these guys pop in there. We've got cabinets galore. They do such a great job of storage in this kitchen. They know it's for full-time permanent living. So they do utilize every nook and cranny possible. I'm loving this wood trim up here, you guys. So make sure you notice that uh, some nice accents in here, the backsplash, the honeycomb backsplash here with the grating. It does add a really nice finish. Okay. Onto the fridge. Look at this beauty here. This is a 12 volt refrigerator. So we can talk to you a little bit more about that when uh, you come see us, but you got your nice big crisper here, all those shelves there. It's beeping telling me I'm open too long already. And then we've got more fridge space here. Nope, crystals, freezer space here. <laughs> and then more freezer space down here. So you won't be shortage of fridge space, that's for sure. Especially with the stainless steel, it looks really nice and sharp. Alrighty, the hutch, the coffee zone, the crock pot holder, whatever you wanna call it. Tons of nice counter space in here. Two plugins on each side, so you won't run out of 
electricity that way. This is that honeycomb backsplash I was telling you guys about. So it adds a little bit of nice texture. The grates here, use it for wine. I don't care, whatever you prefer, or just leave it open for decoration. And then I'm gonna slip through here, show you some open cabinetry. So tons more space. We've got more cupboard doors down here. It, the storage never ends in this place, you guys. And then one more little one around here. As you probably have noticed, it does come installed with central vac as well. You may or may not use it, but it is there. So it's a nice feature. Let's go to the island. Solid surface countertops. I love this. Really nice big stainless steel basin on this side. Just antifreeze, don't mind that. A little bit smaller over here. This is the exact style I have in my house. So that's awesome. A little drinking water here if you've got that ability on your site. And then the two-toned residential faucet. So these are, I'm telling you, I love the looks of these. Okay, swing over here if you can for me. And then we've got two nice sized drawers up here. Everybody loves drawers in their trailer. And then even two more bigger ones here. So lots of pot storage. If you wanna even keep your plates down low, don't like them up high, they're a bit heavy. That's really easy to do. And then we've got wide open space underneath the sink. Plenty of room for a nice large garbage can. Already, I'm loving that they incorporated the wood in here. Remember those wood accents I was telling you about? They did it on the table. Looks really sharp, really ties it all together. We've got four freestanding chairs with storage underneath here. So lots of room. These back up quite a bit, you guys, so you're not kind of squishing into your table. Got lots of space to play cards with the family. One more thing I'm gonna mention is the skylight right here in the middle of the kitchen. It's awesome. Gaze at the stars, see the rain clouds coming in, gives you a little extra light in here. Okay, follow me down the hallway, you guys. You've got your control panel here, really easily accessible, all these nice big buttons. It is hydraulic slides, so we can tell you a little bit more about that too when you come see us, but one slide button does it all. You just hold it, does all the work. Thermostat is right here, and then your washroom is located right here. Okay, into the bathroom, you've got your fancy porcelain foot flush toilet. You've got a really nice size vanity with storage below and above. You've got some counter space there, but you've got some space to move. That's the great thing about this bathroom. Corner shower in here. And then my absolute favorite part is hiding behind the door. We have a wall of linen and toiletry storage in here. So you don't have to hide the towels upstairs in the kids area. You've got plenty of room down here. Hello, I'm up here. Come see me. Come around the corner and see what I've got in store for you. Alrighty, I'm upstairs. I've got my own AC. That's really important to myself and my kids that they aren't being steamed out up here. So it's great that there is an AC unit up here. Nice big window over there as well. Two single beds. Over here, we've got a little nightstand. So if they've got glasses or they like to read books or bring a water bottle or something to bed, you can hide the iPads in there too if you want. Plugins, USB chargers. And then right in front of me, we've got some more storage and the location for the TV. Alrighty, into the master bedroom. So if you guys got switched around, this is at the rear of the trailer, so keep that in mind. It does have the slide in here. We optioned in a king bed. Everyone loves a little touch of luxury even when you're camping. You've got the window at the head. You've got the window at your feet. And you got a window on the side, so lots of ventilation in here. I'm gonna show you the storage. It's so great in here. Hanging storage there. We've got drawers down here on this side. I'm gonna switch the corner here. More drawers on this side, so kind of like a built-in dresser. You could put a TV here if you wanted. It is prepped and wired for it. And then we've got washer dryer prep in here as well. Now, if you don't wanna use a washer dryer, this shelf in here will fold and pop down so you can utilize this for a little bit more hanging space if you want, or a bin down here for extra shoes or those little bit warmer clothes that you have to bring. Alrighty, folks, once again, my name is Tamara. Thank you for joining me on the tour of the 2023 Keystone 401 Loft. If you want to check this out, maybe make an appointment, come see us, or check out anything else we've got on the lot, look us up at modernsleisureworld.com.